Good afternoon, YouTube World. Old Yower, aka K Bird in Beaver Creek, Ohio. And as you can tell, business is really hopping. <laughs> Sarcastically. All their stuff is overpressed. What you looking at? Just, that's a woman's stuff. <laughs> it's all junk, though. Members get 25 points. Yeah, they've been purchasing this rewards pro pushing this rewards program even though it's junk and only two people inside the little Caesars yep yep look at this right here hardly anybody here Sunday afternoon <laughs> Sunday fun day the lease on this store was supposed to be up in last month but for some reason it's still open let's see clearance $3.99, that, that, that really ain't no buy. They had it at Walmart for like one or two dollars recently. The oh, yeah. Long Johns. Who wants to buy all this old granny? <laughs> These are all their granny clothes. <laughs> yeah. Hey, they're playing Bee Gees Night Fever. <laughs> ain't no ain't no fever in here going on. Yeah, look at this YouTube. Look how dead this place is. Yeah, but who in the world's gonna take their kids here for shoes though? Hell there ain't that many people here. What? Spider-Man Spider -Man shoes. shoes. Yeah, they got some other shoes. Yeah, we grew up with Spider-Man. <laughs> some Disney. Some Disney. And Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. You could tell, you could tell the men's section, they, they definitely significantly reduced it. I guess selling swim trunks, I guess. <laughs> you could tell the quality of them is not very good. But even the quality of these aren't very good, these Northwest Territories. But these right here, you can buy these at Walmart for like 12 or $13. These, they're all overpriced. Additional 40% off clearance. Don't look like anybody's buying it though. Don't look like anybody's buying it. What? My friend, he's with me today, out here doing a video view, and came out here view this morgue. It's about it's about five o'clock on a Sunday afternoon, and this place, and this place is about as dead as it comes. Right, Thomas? Yeah. This ain't place nobody ain't nobody here. You hear that, YouTube? Sunday fun day for old Yower. This is about only a few people in the aisles. Oh yeah, it's a junk and like this stuff right here. Like look at like look like look look at these slippers. Just 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 look at look at how freaking cheap these slippers are made. And they want like fourteen dollars for these. Five dollars would be overpriced it would be enough. Yeah, just look how pathetic the material is on this. I mean, it's so cheaply made. It's kind of funny that they're clearance in Dayton Flyers and Cincinnati Red stuff. But even then, they look at look, look at this crap. It's regularly priced twenty four, and they've only reduced it to nineteen. That thing's not even worth five dollars. That thing's not even worth five dollars and baseball season is supposed to be starting up and yet they're clearance in this but it kind of makes me wonder if they're getting ready to have a you know if their liquidation sale because yeah. seeing a lot of clearance stuff <laughs> oh there well there's not enough people hey thomas here's a bullet for you but it's a cheap one right. just look at just look at how cheap this 
regularly only six bucks and it's discounted to five. Look how cheap this, look how cheap that, look how cheap that crap is. What? It probably wouldn't even last a day for anybody. Oh, look at the look, look at this crap. Regularly, nine dollars to sixty nine dollars. These right here over here are not much better either. Look at these. Look like like right here. Look feel feel how cheap that leather is. Yeah, look how cheap this. Yeah, look how cheap. Look how cheap this this leather is. And it's kind of funny. Looking at the price of these Wranglers, you could get these for about 12 or 13 at Walmart. And they're 17 here. Sun protection. Oh, here's another thing that's overpriced. And check this out. This hat is so thinly made, and believe me, YouTube, I have a ton of these that I wear, Thomas. Just yeah. just feel yeah, yeah. feel feel how cheap that material yeah. is. That is just utter junk. Most of their stuff is just cheap junk it's just it ain't even well made <laughs> yeah thomas it ain't let's 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 have a look at their shoe prices but yeah you could tell just i mean just feel how thin that is compared to the one you get at walmart that is so thin and cheap and it's like 13 bucks versus nine dollars there Oh, let's see how much their shorts are. Well, nineteen dollars. You can get these for fifteen. Because all this crap is just so cheaply made and of such poor quality. Buy one, get one free. Oh, Thomas, look at look at this price. Just how stupid this price is right here. One ninety nine to eighty nine dollars for a pair of shoes <laughs> or family footwear. They're this store's lucky if they see eighty nine dollars in business a day. <sighs> Buy one, get one free. Yeah, they're all cheap crap. Now this well these right here might be okay. Phone. You could get that at almost anywhere. Here you got the Crocs right here, which are not bad if you got a Ford, a River, or on the beach. But let's take a look at their boots right here. Let's see, nineteen dollars for this pair of boots, but feel how cheap this is. They're regularly thirty-nine, but they're so cheaply made. I mean, it's all cheap junk. So yeah, this is basically why Kmart is basically going out of business because all this cheap crap that they've overpriced and the quality of it sucks. Let's see, with let's see Texas Steer, and plus even this, the material is is suspect at best. Thomas, look at this right here. Even the material of this is suspect at best. I guess they got some of the girls shoes right here even then that's a little bit thicker but even then the material was so thinly on top it's it's just junk Everlast shoes <laughs> hey look feel 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 how cheaply that leather is right there that is just junk. Ain't really good, I don't think. Or whatever it is, it's just junk. It's not even that thick. And their shoestrings, you could get shoestrings at Walmart good ones for like a dollar and feel how cheaply these are. Those aren't even that thick. And boot strings. I could buy the wax boots for my boots like I can at Walmart for these for about a, a dollar, those wax strings. Oh, yeah. yeah, the wax strings are much better 
shoe strengths for boots they don't wear out as easy yep old yower look at this store Rich. this place just feels like a complete morgue and when you look at all this overpriced junk now it's kind of funny how they clearance kentucky wildcat stuff after they've already lost yeah. in the tournament And this blanket, this little mini blanket, that's, that ain't nothing. It's a cheap junk. This, cu this cup is okay, this Bengals cup, but it's not that good of quality. Oh, yeah, here, here, here's another thing. Feel, feel, feel how thin this is. This crap would, hey, Thomas, this right here would fall apart in the washer just after the first load. Just feel, feel, feel this material, how... That thing is so poorly made. It's not even funny. Team Beach Ball. It's not really summer yet. Hey, look at this. They're selling inflatable tubes. <laughs> inflatable tubes, inflatable beach balls. Frisbee. <laughs> what? I wonder how, oh, yeah, look, look, look right here. He, even this backpack is yeah, kind of thin. Yeah. It's thinly made, so all this crap is just junk. Brain in the service desk, brain in the service desk. So who, who's coming to service desk? Ain't nobody here to service. Let's see, they got WWE Smackdown Trainer. What's this right here? Heavy bag. Look at this, Thomas. It's discounted to $9.99 and it's regularly $24. <laughs> Heavy bag. This thing wouldn't even last. Yeah. That thing wouldn't even last. That's for kids, dude. Yeah, kickboxing trainer. That thing wouldn't even last for an adult, even a. Now, why are they even selling golf balls? Who in the world and golf equipment? Who's going to come here to this broke, sorry store for. Golf equipment. <laughs> hey, look, they even sell kayaks here. I didn't know they. As I said, oh yeah, feel, 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 feel just how cheap this plastic is. You, you, you couldn't bring that out on the river without drowning. You'd be drowning on this thing. Yeah, you'd be drowning on that thing. Coleman Coors, well, <laughs> yeah, a lot of this stuff is just not selling basketball. Hey, look, look, look at this. They, they got the Army camo, 19 bucks, but you could probably get that for 9 or 10 at most other places. <laughs> so it's just, yeah, but none of it's selling, though. Baseball mitts. <laughs> Baseball mitts. Yeah, look how dead this place is, man. Yeah, Thomas, this this place is a morgue. <laughs> hey, what do you mean it getting there? It already is. Tennis rackets and footballs. <laughs> You know, a lot of people don't know this. They actually make the football somewhere in Ohio. Yeah, I know. The NFL footballs. I think it. I can't remember the name of the town. <laughs> Socks, ladies, stuff, hosiery, but no ladies are probably coming here to get this junk right here. <laughs> Some more sporting good stuff. Some candles right here. Treadmill, yeah, right. Yeah, I know, I know, but it still is junk, though. Mm. A good treadmill cost a lot. AJ, right, like, right, right to feel that material. That material is no good for a treadmill. 12 foot. 12 foot. Let's see, their trampoline is 189. It's discounted from 349. So it seems like they're trying to move, move some inventory out of here. Because they're losing so much money and it's <coughs> yeah. 
pretty obvious why when you look at the state of the store. What? Check out what the padded chair. Oh, it's right underneath there. 36. 36, they're right underneath there. Way too expensive and cheaper than that. You can go to, uh, you can probably go to, uh, yeah, you could buy them for. You got a minority of them cheaper than that. Probably get them for 15 or less. Ice pack. Yeah. Bengals here, yep. And the brown. Browns here, yeah. They had nothing selling, though. Let's see, what's this right here? Some kind of foam, oh, weightlifting pad. Foam tile flooring for weightlifting. Ain't nobody gonna buy that for their gym, though. Let's see, let's let's have a look at their, see, they're, they're discounting some of their teenage, they're discounting stuff, but it's just not selling. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Yeah, yeah, me, yeah me and you grew up with that cartoon. Yeah, like we watched all the good cartoons, but yeah, let's take a look at these bikes right here. Junk, of course. Yeah, look, Long feel. Years, that's a good bike. Now, some of them are. This is a good frame right here. This yeah. This is like for like, uh, this is like off-road. Yeah, so the tire's not very good on it. You'd have to get different tires for it, but. They're trying to move inventory, but it's just, they're just not selling anything. Yep. Yeah. Hey Thomas, you you need an overpriced coffee thermostat? <laughs> Twenty four dollars for it. I don't think I'd pay that for it. You could get you 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 could get you could get it for less than that. Vacuum bags, you could get these for less than uh, that price. Tough storage box, you could get these for less than that. Less than 14 And then right here, these are so cheaply made. Look at this right here, the plastic ain't yeah. worth a darn on it. You get much better tubs than, than this crap that they're selling. Oh, look at this right here. Look how overpriced this is. 29 bucks for silverware. You could buy all this at, at dollar stores and pick your own pieces for yeah. for 10 bucks. Get the same amount as you could in there. Yeah. It's all junk. Yep, this should this should YouTube show you the sad state of affairs for Kmart and you know and recently, their CEO made some comments that we may not be able to make it through business much longer because they're running out of cash. Can't open it. How much is how, how much is it? But let's see what the price is on it. That thing ain't worth one fifty. How much is it regularly? Two bucks. That ain't no discount. Last time I bought a can opener, it was like eight or nine bucks. Cause you got to get a good one. That ain't a good one. Need some hangers. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just joking. <laughs> 199 for hangers, you'd get them for a dollar at most places. Yeah, dollar something. 75 cents a dollar. So let's take a look at their furniture. And the when the wood finish is not even that good on this. Table is like uh, Pine breakfast nook three night three hundred. Yeah, Glenview dining table two forty nine. Yep, old yower. Oh yeah, cheap ass table that's way overpriced. Yeah, that shouldn't even be a hundred. I seen I seen be about maybe maybe a hundred. I'm not even sure what kind of wood that's even made out of. It's so cheaply made. No, Ikea would have better quality stuff than that. Yeah, look how dead this place is, man. Take a look at their housewares. Ah, Kenmore used to be a better brand, but not so much anymore. 
Sears is actually trying to sell Kenmore to raise assets because they're running out of money. Hey, look, look, look right here at the layaway section. Nobody's back there to staff it. That's because nobody would buy anything from here. Two slice toaster. Hey, Thomas, look, look at this crap. You could get that for probably 19, I bet, at most places. I got one for 14. Yeah. Oh, you hear that, YouTube? And Kmart. And Kmart. That was many moons ago. Are you yeah, sure it wasn't was Walmart? Like five years ago. You sure it wasn't Walmart? No, it's Kmart. That's one half one. Yeah, hell, this, let's see. Self, let's see. Self storage unit, 32, only discounted $7. Self storage unit, I guess, for pots and pans, dish strainers, <laughs> and just just look right here, thirteen bucks for that. You that, that shouldn't be no more than seven or eight dollars. And and right here, feel, feel how cheap, feel how cheap that that crap is. It it's all this stuff is just junk. It's junk that's overpriced. If they want to sell stuff, they need to discount stuff a lot more than this. Rebrand themselves. Hey, Thomas, let's take a look at how much their kitty litter is. <laughs> uh, their cat litter stuff is about regular price. As you get it for almost anywhere else. Oh yeah, Walmart, Myers. Yeah, we'll keep on going. Yeah, look at all this. Let's see, one dollar compared to Michael's. I got news for you, people. People aren't coming here for crafts. They're gonna go to a real craft store like Michael's or Joanne's. <laughs> yep. And you, you see, you see, Thomas, right here, you could tell they practically reduced their electronics. is almost down to next thing to nothing. They got nothing there. Yeah, barely anything at all. And you see, they used to have a cash register back here. They got rid of that. See, right here, temporary price up. You see, what they're going to do is, once they announce the, once they announce their liquidation sale, what they're going to do is, though, they're, they're going to jack that price up to over $500. That's what they do. They'll add like 20% on to the regular price. Like $529 right there. That range will be $600 and they'll claim there's a discount. Loaded out of order. Yeah, right. Who's gonna who's what's out of order here? Member deal. Shop your way member deal. That's nothing but a scam. Yeah, this is pretty much what they've left their electronics with. Toothpicks. Uh, they might be okay, but... Uh, plastic's kind of cheap. Plastic's cheap on them. But I'm not even sure if those are even Wi-Fi enabled or not. I can't even... Bluetooth, yeah, which is what I mean. I don't even know if they are Bluetooth. Yeah, those used to be more in style years ago till everything went wireless, but still might be. They got sound bars, I mean, for a home speaker, for home theaters. Do you want to experience virtual surround sound? Introducing Nakamichi's 32-inch sound bar home theater system featuring Nakamichi. Nakamichi. That's okay. This one's 300 watts. This other one's 400 watts. Want to that one's even better. Sound. Introducing Nakamichi's 38 inch surround. Yeah. Looking for a true dynamic uh, listening experience for your movies good, and music? It's kind of blurry. Nakamichi's 38 inch surround. Sounds kind of blurry on it. Yeah, but you know this is this is what they've pretty much reduced their electronics to. And you see, you have to have electronics to stay in business. And look, they there's barely anything here. And they got rid of their old cash registers back here. You know, if you ever 
found something here to buy, pay them with a roll of dimes because that's what the company's worth, dimes. They don't even draw a dime. Yeah, look at this right here. It's all... Yep, they, it ain't gonna be Wi-Fi router. Who's gonna buy a Wi-Fi router from this crap? Regularly 34 bucks. Nobody's gonna buy a Wi-Fi router from this broke-ass store. Uh, they're okay. You can get... Most of the time, the cable... Or your uh, yeah. or your or your internet provider just provides it. Yeah. You don't even have to buy one anymore. Yeah. A little bit of a book selection, but hey, Harry Potter. Huh. Hey, I got a Harry Potter. Harry Potter and the Cursed Child, parts one and two. Ain't nobody buying them. Here's a coloring book head. Now, now this right here, you get this for seven or eight bucks. That's like eleven sixty nine junk, overpriced. Yeah, Craftsman. Now Sears sold Craftsman, but apparently they're trying to clear out the last of their Craftsman stuff. Stanley Black and Decker bought them recently. Oh, yeah, because they. The, the, Sears is trying to sell as much of their stuff as possible to raise money because they're running out of money. Uh, step stools and step ladders. Uh, you get one somewhere else that's a lot better. You might could get one a better price at somewhere else. Step ladders right here. Or step stools. Ah, oh, you get them better priced at other places. You get them better priced somewhere else, I bet. You I mean Craftsman used to be really good a brand, but not anymore. Yeah, I mean Sears used to. I mean Craftsman used to be some of the best tools out there. No, not by. They're not regarded as very good anymore. They used to be. Staplers. Hey, Saul. Huh. It's cheaply made, though. Look, look at this right here. Now, this is one thing I would consider buying. It's a, it's a saw. But then again, it may get that cheaper somewhere else. Six forty-nine. Hey, level. Are we level? Yes, we're level. Are we level? Make sure the floor is level, Thomas. Yes, we're level, but make sure you make sure that you use glue. Otherwise, your stuff will fall apart. This one contractor said, if you don't use a glue level and screws, your work is crap. Because yeah. if you don't glue it and screw it, glue it and screw it. <laughs> Breed of water filters. Yeah. Hot Wheels, I, me and you, I know, used to collect these yeah, I used when to I was younger. Every yeah. Time my uh, brother decided to get my shit to my nephew. Yeah, I used to. Now, now I don't have nothing now. There's yeah, I, I, I still there. might have some around somewhere. I don't know where they're at, but Hot Wheels, they're 89 cents. They're normally 109. Hot Wheels. I used to collect those when I was younger. Let's go over here this way. Well, actually, we'll cut through this section right here. Yep. Old Yower. Old Yower. We'll, we'll get ready to go out. We've seen enough to... See, it's overpriced and junk. They're on their way out. Yeah, look, I mean, it's Sunday afternoon about 5 o'clock. Hey, 
Yo, 59, yeah, hell yeah, that's way overpriced. And they're regularly 100 bucks for this crap. You can probably get them cheaper at Menards. You could probably get them for 25 or 30. You can probably get them cheaper at Menards. Yeah. Really. Yeah, but. This stuff's at Menards too. Yeah, uh, it's at everywhere. Yeah, but look, but look right now, this place is like a morgue. This place is. Yeah, this place is. It's, I mean, hey, 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 Thomas, hey, Thomas, guess what? I have a great idea for this store. After they're done, since Montgomery County needs more space for their coroner's office because of all the heroin overdoses, maybe they could use this for a, a morgue. Yeah. <laughs> maybe they could use this for a morgue because that's basically yeah, what it is. We'll get ready to go out this way, but yeah, look at this right here. Only two lines open, and only and and then look look. There's only about not even five people in line. Not even in line. Don't worry about it, man. It's not even in line. Who's gonna buy cigarettes here? Wow. Don't worry about it, man. No. But right here, one final look at the parking lot. This place is like a morgue in here right now. <coughs> they call security. Yeah, I don't I don't worry about it. We I mean it's not like we did anything. Yeah, but look at this right here. Five o'clock in the afternoon. The parking lot's a pretty good reflection of what's in the store. Hardly anybody here. Yep. This place is like a freaking morgue. If this doesn't tell you Kmart's dead, then I don't know what <laughs> what doesn't. And you know, you know what, you know what? It's almost hard to believe that if their lease was up last month, that this store was not closed. I mean, it's it's a freaking morgue. They gotta get rid of all their shit. <laughs> yeah, if they better discount it and s even more. I gotta sit down, man. <laughs> yeah, we will in a few minutes. Yeah, it's kind of funny, you know, YouTube, check this out. As I end this video, they brought in a bunch of mulch and shit. Who the hell is gonna buy mulch? Mulch and seed. Mulch and seed at this run down freaking store. I mean, plus it's kind of funny. Most people could just probably come here at night and just probably jack this shit. It ain't like anybody ever freaking see you. <laughs> they could just freaking load this shit up. Freaking gone. 